all who desire a deeper study in the Word of God are invited to join Bishop Wooden for the Ministers in Training class. The next session will be held Tuesday, January 4th at 7.30 p.m. in the Sanctuary. Our next baptism service will be held Sunday, January 9th at 6 p.m., and all candidates should arrive at the church by 5.15 p.m. Interested candidates should call the church at 919-829-6160 to provide your name and receive further instructions. Oh, magnify the Lord with me and let us exalt his name together. If you are in or visiting the Raleigh area and looking for an opportunity to gather with the saints for a God-first experience, the Upper Room is pleased to offer two services every Sunday morning. Join us at 8 a.m. and 11 a.m. for Sunday worship service in the sanctuary. You can also join the Upper Room Church of God in Christ every Sunday at 11 a.m. and Thursdays at 7.30 p.m. for the live stream of our services on Facebook Live and YouTube Live. Bishop Patrick L. Wooden Sr. will bring a fresh word from the Lord relevant to our times and equip you to contend for the faith. Thank you to our viewers throughout the United States and abroad for your weekly support of our broadcast. Please be reminded there are several ways to give to the Upper Room Church of God in Christ. For online giving, please visit easytithe.com forward slash URC. Also, please use only one email address for each Easy Tithe account so we can properly track your giving. Within Easy Tithe, you can now initiate the Recur option, which allows you to select a designated amount to be automatically deducted from your account. You may also visit our website, upperroomgospel.org, and select the Giving tab. Or you can mail your gift to the Upper Room Church of God in Christ, Post Office Box 447. Garner, North Carolina, 27529. As always, thank you very much for supporting the Upper Room Church of God in Christ. The Upper Room Church of God in Christ now has a new mobile app available for immediate download and use. The app features sermons, easy tithe giving, events and registrations, our church calendar, prayer request, and more. Visit your device's app store, search Upper Room Church app, and look for the church logo. Once downloaded, select the profile icon and enter your credentials. If you already have an Easy Tithe account, please use the email address or login information associated with that account. This feature allows you to see your Easy Tithe giving history, join groups, and much more. Stay connected to your church through the Upper Room Church app. Hello, I'm Bishop Patrick L. Wooden Sr., and I want to take the time to invite you to attend the Acts 6 and 4 conference to be held on January the 4th through the 6th in uh, Texarkana, Texas, January 4th through the 6th at the Texarkana Convention Center. Conference Chair Jason Stidham has invited me to minister during the 10 a.m. service on January the 5th, and I look forward to seeing you there. The Vision Keepers 2022 Leadership Conference, Influence, will feature spirit-filled, thought-provoking sessions and activities to strengthen you as a leader. It starts Thursday, January 13th at 7.30 p.m. right here at the Upper Room with a powerful word from our pastor, Bishop Patrick L. Wooden Sr. The conference continues Saturday, January 15th from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. at North Raleigh Christian Academy for a day of fellowship, including breakout sessions with Evangelist Emel Hope, Elder John Amanchuku, Brother Christopher Ferguson, Elder Damian Little, the Upper Room Riders, President of the Vision Keepers Conference, Elder Anthony Wilson, and many others. Sunday morning, January 16th, we'll return to the Upper Room for two services at 8 a.m. and 11 a.m., once again with our pastor, Bishop Patrick L. Wooden Sr. All members working and volunteering in a capacity at the church are encouraged to participate, so make plans to attend. Registration is free and requested for food headcount as boxed luncheons will be included. There will also be several drawings during the Saturday session for all registrants, and you must be present to receive gifts. Temperature checks will be in place as a precaution at both locations. 